All right, so I, I'm, I'm gonna do some inner. I, I I don't like doing internet capping, but I'm gonna real quick because it's funny as shit. I was just watching uh, I was just watching uh, Wall Wall Vicky the uh, the Wall Vicky uh rice gum disc. That's just funny as hell. I like uh, I like the Wall Vicky uh bad baby disc. This the Wall Vicky bad baby disc. Um. I like the wall, Vicky. Uh, don't like me. Could never cash app in the city with it, Big Vic. I be, I don't really spend all day on wall, Vicky shit, but I do like listening to though. But on the other hand, in this neighborhood, these young, these young punks and these young girls, they can't they can't even be down with the motherfuckers they're supposed to be down with. That's how pathetic. And no, nah, for real, man. That's the sad when. When you got people in your, you know, even kids in the neighborhood, like teenagers, boys and girls, like 17, 18, 19, and they can't even be down with the people they're supposed to be down with. Shit's got me fucked up, man. But yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show Battle Creek uh, what I'll be driving, so if you want to pull up on me, go ahead. Take your chance, just like I'm taking mine. Y'all want to bust? Leave on the bus back. I just got done washing that, but I was just listening to that rice gum, uh, well, Vicky rice, uh, rice gum dish track, and I was like, I was looking around this day, I'm like, these motherfucking, these fucking teenagers and young adults and these old people, and in and, and reality, in real life, they can't even be down with the people they're supposed to be down with. And these people, and these people around here have no ties with anybody in in this neighborhood or Battle Creek. I got ties over in the Philippines. I got ties in uh, the Philippines. Let's see. I know I got ties in the Philippines. I know I got ties in the Philippines, but uh, uh, there's probably other foreign countries I got ties with. But I got ties with every state in America. By cutting personal checks, not, but I, I listen. I was doing personal checks back in 2003. This is 2000, and, about to be 2020. This is about to be 2021. I was, I listen. I still cut checks to this day, and I've been doing it since 20. Oh, what 2003? And then when I got on probation, at the end, uh, no. It was uh, the end of 1999 and the beginning of 2000. I was put on probation, and I I had to pay $1,600 cash. So I'd go down there like weekly, every two like week, two weeks through. I take like three, four hundred bucks in cash, and pay that. They don't let you off probation unless you pay them the money you owe them, because you got to pay for your being in jail. You got to pay for the court costs. You got to pay your lawyer. I would I would still be in trouble with the law if I would have never paid my my fees to to the uh for being in jail for the food and the housing I, um I had to pay my lawyer um I had to pay uh the court cost the court fee and that was it came to like thir anywhere in between the 1300 1300 1600 but I had that paid off probably I think about 6 months before I got up, I had them my whole thing paid up for about six months before I got up probation. So yeah, y'all want to get somewhere in life, get a job, get some money. You know what I'm saying?